My name is Terence Chan. I'm the Vice President of the Tian Ho Hong Kong and Macau Youth Entrepreneurship Association. I'm 31 years old. Um, I was born and raised in Hong Kong and I've been a young entrepreneur in uh, the Greater Bay Area. So it's great to hear that you have a very promising future ahead of you. So now we've entered China's two session time. So two sessions will summarize what has been achieved last year and what will the government be doing this year, uh, covering a wide range of topics. So you're in Hong Kong now. I know you and some young Hong Kongers now are paying close attention to the two sessions. So what topic that is on the top of your discussed list? Um, from a young entrepreneur from Hong Kong, uh, from our point of view, of course, we most look forward to the policies about entrepreneurship supports in the Greater Bay Area. Mm -hmm. uh, we especially hope that there will be more support for us uh, on, on taxation policies, on um, um, housing policies, allowing more and more young entrepreneurs uh, from Hong Kong, like myself, uh, to chase our dreams in the Greater Bay Area right now. So how do you and young Hong Kongers in Hong Kong engage in these discussions? Um, the test two sessions are one of the most important national meetings in, in China, uh, making national level decisions that would not only affect the national economy in China, but also affecting the world economy as China has become one of the greatest countries in history. Mm. As a uh, young entrepreneur from Hong Kong, we pay very high attention uh, to the two sessions through uh, TV broadcasts. Uh, we enjoy every minute of it because it really matters in our future. Mm -hmm. Since the outbreak of the COVID-19 pandemic, you've been in Hong Kong, but I know you've been keeping a close contact with the mainland here. So what have you done in the fight against this pandemic? Uh, we've actually done a lot. Um, Yes, I've been stuck in Hong Kong for almost five months now uh, since the Chinese New Year break actually, uh, keeping myself and my parents safe from the COVID-19 breakout. Um, during the economy breakdown, um, many startups have been suffering badly due to the lack of income, of course. Um, the Tianhe and Hong Kong and Macau Youth Entrepreneurship Association has been providing all kinds of supports. Uh, to our members, including providing mm. them with medical supports and supplies to make sure that they're safe, um, providing them uh, financial support with our bank partners. Um, and very importantly, since our startups are facing huge challenges, uh, we have been holding a different uh, online forums every single week, providing them lectures as well as forums to our startups in different topics. Uh, we just want our startups to uh, stay strong and uh, <laughs> get through this uh, suffering period. Do you have any hope to Hong Kong and to the mainland? Of course we have a lot of hope. Um, after the COVID-19 period, uh, we understand that the economy of uh, both mainland and Hong Kong are facing really, really huge challenges in the coming months. Um, but as young entrepreneur like myself from Hong Kong, uh, we believe in ourselves. Uh, and more importantly, mm -hmm. uh, we believe in our great government under the leadership of President Xi. Um, there are always ups and downs. Um, mm -hmm. Our economy has started to get back up again right now. And I really look forward to our future and make sure our young dreams come true in the Greater Bay Area. Mm. So thank you very much, Terence, for joining you. us today on FaceTime. And hope you can join us again sometime. Thank you very much. Thank you, Sunny.